y'all and welcome to Our Green Acres. I'm Teresa. Thanks for coming on today. And if you are new to our channel, I want to give you a big welcome. And also, if you have not subscribed to our channel, we'd love for you to just hit the red subscribe button up on the screen. Also, at the end of the video, I'm going to put my Facebook home decor page. Love for you to go over and join it. And also, I'll have uh, the name of my Instagram account. And it's Our Green Acres. Ends with an E. Please go over and follow me on Instagram. So y'all, today's video is gonna be centered around Mother's Day. We all know Mother's Day is right around the corner and um, with the situation that we're, we're all in right now, going out and shopping for a lot of us is not an option. So we're trying to you know, find things that we can access online or just come up with in our home that we can create and um, it, you know, and, and make something out of stuff that we already have. And so Mother's Day is probably going to be no exception. So I wanted to bring y'all some ideas and some inspiration for maybe some, some Mother's Day gifts. Or if you have a special occasion coming up uh, that you need a gift for, like my daughter's birthday is next week. So um, so I've got several options. So um, y'all stay tuned and I'm going to go through each one um, at, you know, separately so I don't forget anything. Okay, y'all, the first option that I'm going to give you for inspiration and gift ideas is I have partnered up with a company called Thread Tank. They are a t-shirt specialty company, and I tell you what, their t-shirts go, they, they kick their t-shirts up a notch. They reached out to me and asked if I would want to do a collaboration with them and also be able to offer my viewers uh, a promotion code where you get 10% off and I'm going to have that up on the screen and also I'll put it in the description box below but if you put my, my promo code in you will get 10% off your entire order and y'all 10% that that's a great savings and also if you order up until April the 30th you will get guaranteed shipment for Mother's Day and they will also deliver straight to your recipient so if you don't want it to come to your house and you just want it to go straight to your mother or the person you want to send your gift to, they will also accommodate that. They, they make everything in-house and they make it to order. And I have to tell y'all, I'm so impressed with their products. I got a sweatshirt and I got two t-shirts. And like I say, their t-shirts are just, um, they're, they're geared for, um, for any kind of style that you desire, they have different colors, different sizes. They have them for ladies, toddlers, children, men. And their sizes, they have a broad range of sizes. And like I say, in styles. So this is one of them that I got. We have a golden retriever dog, Bella. And I love this. And this is called the Slouchy T. It has more of a loose fit and um, very soft, comfortable fabric, very good quality, and you get to choose what slogans you want. And their, their main um, objective for their company is they want to tell your story. So they have many slogans out there, whatever you like. If you love pets, or if you're a grandmother, you're a mom, you're a dad, um, great little slogans for, for, little, for little children. Um, you know, if you like coffee, wine, they have Christian base. They have tons of crafting t-shirts that are awesome. So um, the, the three that I selected, and y'all, I want to get more because I'm so impressed with them. And um, like I say, they're not your ordinary t-shirt. This is one that I got, and this is um, in the Heather Gray, and it's called Worry Ends When Faith Begins. So I love this one. This one I actually wore yesterday because it was chilly here. Um, we still have chilly mornings and chilly nights here in Alabama. So this one was perfect. They have like sweatshirts and they have, you know, um, a variety of sweatshirts. If you like the, the kind that comes up with the crew neck, they have those. And they also have this one. It's more of a slouchy fit, which I prefer. And it has like a quarter length sleeve, but just the perfect layering for just a chilly day that you want something that's not going to, you know, you're going to burn up in, but something that's just going to keep you comfortable. So I wore this one yesterday and absolutely love it. So I'm going to put the links to the t-shirts and the sweatshirt that I got. So if you're interested, 
So I want to offer you that option. I think that's a great online um, gift option for anybody. Like I say, if you're thinking about Mother's Day, if you've got a birthday, Father's Day is going to be right around the corner also. And, you know, and each state is going, you know, by, by their governor and their rules. So who knows when some of us will be able to get out. So it's great to have good online um, options. So just wanted to um, give y'all that information and that's one option. So now we're going to go to option two. Okay, y'all, option two, I'm trying to give y'all inspiration and, um, and ideas in case you can't go out and shop and you don't want to, um, um, you know, risk going out somewhere and if you're at Walmart Grand Groceries, you know, you don't have the time to go and really shop for a gift. And like I say, we've all got Mother's Day right around the corner, so we're wanting to kind of gear up and get ready. So, and then two, two, a lot of us have been affected so many different ways with the pandemic. You know, some people have lost their jobs. They've taken cuts in pay. You know, we're on tight budgets. So I want to give you options of things that would be budget friendly also, and also put a sentimental touch on it. Cause I think any mother um, would, would love any of this stuff. So the first one that I want to um, tell y'all about is gonna be the little buckets. And I had like a stash of buckets that I got at Dollar Tree. This one actually come from Dollar General. It was 450, but these little galvanized buckets, and I think a lot of us has got a stash of these. Uh, Dollar Tree, pr pretty much all the Dollar Trees, I think have carried these at one time or another, but they're just the little galvanized flower and garden buckets. So, you know, for $1, take your bucket, paint it whatever color you think your mom would like. And then I just got out and printed out on my, on my printer on regular computer paper, just some family photos. And this is me and my daughter from last Mother's Day. And I just, um, the products that I use to do this, I'll have in the video, but I use Gorilla Spray Adhesive. That's one option. You'll get like a smoother, um, you know, finish to it. And then also I used um, this Mod Podge and this is good. It's very water resistant. This is for fabric, but you can use any Mod Podge, but this right here will not wash off. Like if you get it wet, it's going to protect, you know, what you, what, what it is on. And then also um, I've used this clear glaze and I'm going to show y'all the coasters that you can coat um, your coasters with that will keep it, them from being damaged. And then I've also got spray Mod Podge. So if you've got any of these in your stash, any of these will work. And this is the, some of the things that I use for today's projects. But I just took the little bucket and then I just added some tissue paper. And then you can just add whatever you want to your bucket. You can theme it whatever, you know, thing that your mom likes. If she likes baked goods, maybe bake your mom some goodies and put in it. Uh, if she likes bath accessories, you know, put, you know, put like hand soaps. I've got some bath bombs. All of these mainly are Dollar Tree products. And I'm not saying go to Dollar Tree because I'm not going to Dollar Tree <laughs> anytime soon. But these are things that I actually had in my stash from Dollar Tree. I always buy little extra things and I always have little gifts at home just for last minute, um, you know, events. So, you know, and little, little candles. So just, you know, get creative and just put whatever your mom would like in it. And then two, if you don't want to do, you know, family photos, you know, do a thing for your mom. If she likes farmhouse or if she likes cows, you know, print out something off Google Images that would suit your mom. And like I say, just coordinate with some pretty tissue paper and embellish it. And I think this makes a great little gift for your mom. And it's something that's very sentimental and I think it would mean a lot to her. I know as a mom, I would love it. And you know, if you don't have the little, the little buckets, if you've got some like flower pots sitting around, go out, get your flower pot, paint your flower pot, little terracotta pots, or if you have a bigger one, you can use the flower pots. Um, you know, wooden spoons. You know, I did a video um, back um, a few weeks ago on wooden spoons. Paint your wooden spoon or print out, put a picture on your wooden spoon, but get creative, you know, with something like this. This would be something cute that your mom would like. And it would be something that would be unique. Of course, something would be something she would not have already. So there's some ideas 
um, for, for the little, for the little buckets and just, you know, like I say, just use your imagination and, and this one also, this is a Dollar Tree one. Um, and I just spray painted it with some chalk paint. I think it's a serenity blue. And then I just added a couple of little flowers right here. So I thought this one turned out really cute. And like I say, you know, it's the thought that counts. So that's going to be our, um, our DIY inspiration for number one. Okay, y'all, so inspiration number two, DIY, is gonna be coasters. And I know a lot of people will not have <laughs> flooring tile laying around. Um, I used to make coasters at Christmas and I would sell them and a lot of my friends would come and want me to make them and I would get, they're basically, you can make them out of napkins or you can make them again out of family photos. And this is just, again, I printed out on computer paper. So, you know, print out whatever you want um, you can use Mod Podge for these, or you can use the Gorilla Glue. And this is where your clear glaze will come in handy. You want to spray it with this. Once you get your, um, your image on your tile and it dries, then you want to take it out and spray it with the clear glaze really good. And that way it will coat it and it will, will not get damaged from, from getting wet. So I made some of these for you and you'll see this in the video of how I make these. And so basically these are just made out of napkins and you just want to pull your napkin apart and and you'll see in the video because you want just that really, the really thin part of the napkin. And so basically you've got two layers to the napkin and then you'll just spread it, you know, pull it apart and that's all you'll do. And then you'll just um, adhere it to your tile. And, um, and like I say, if you don't have tile laying around, you know, like I say, get creative with your wooden spoons or your flower pots whatever you have to decoupage your image onto. And then the third DIY and inspiration for, for a gift would be um, take your old watches. If you have an old watch, maybe the battery has run down on it and you're not going to replace it and you're just, you know, you just don't wear it anymore. Take your watch and take uh, the back off of it. And you'll see how I do that in the video. But basically, I just had a little screwdriver set and these, actually, these backs popped off very easy. Just take all the insides out of your watch and you just wanna have a clear case left and resize your image and um, cut it out and put it in the watch and make your mom a watch, a, a photo bracelet out of an old watch. So I think these turned out really cute. Um, I, I'm wearing this one and I'm sorry y'all, I'm not very good model with watches because I have tiny wrists. <laughs> but anyway, I'm wearing this one, but I actually put a daughter, a, a picture of me and my daughter in, in both of these watches. But I just kind of wanted to show y'all, you know, how you can, you know, make your old watches work. And I think this would be a great gift. So, um, and then also with the coasters, I didn't mention, um, if you don't want to give, give it to your mom as a coaster, you know, put it in a cute little plate stand and just, and she can set it up and you can do any size coaster or tile that you want to, not coaster, but tile, because I know low sells tile in all different sizes. This size right here, y'all is, is under, I think 20 cents. It's very cheap just to buy one tile. And I've actually got a, a box full. Uh, I keep them on hand just so I can make um, little things out of them. But anyway, you know, you can stand them up like that. All right, sorry y'all, that was the kitty cats that scared me to death and like somebody was knocking. So anyway, that's all I have today. I'm gonna let y'all, you know, watch the video. I've staged it all for you just to give you some inspiration and hopefully give you some, some good ideas for some gift options. Don't forget, please go out and, and check out Thread Tank. And don't forget to use my promo code to get 10% off your order. And they offer free shipping for $45. So y'all, please go check them out. I think you will really like them. Y'all, as always, thanks so much for coming on today. I hope you enjoy the video and I hope you get some inspiration from it. And Tater is gonna, <laughs> she's gonna help me in the video, y'all. So to say hey to Tater. <laughs> Bye, y'all.